we've got a new company, UK company on the market, supplying exactly what we're looking for at the minute. For me, this robotic arm is working really well because it doesn't have a massive framework around the position. It can be retrofitted into any position that at the minute you've got uh, employee working or where you would like to implement a new employee. Regarding installation, everything went really smoothly. We had very good communication between Bryson and Recycli. Uh, the installation team responded to any questions asked, didn't cost it much, everything was prepared outside of working hours. I like myself the design of the robot, of this robot, because at the very beginning we installed a small nozzle and yes, with the hundreds, thousands of movements and picking objects, it didn't last it, so Recycle I responded pretty quickly, changed a lot within the, the design of the pneumatic system and installed a completely different nozzle, different gripper that is lasting much, much more. What I also love about this design and this type of the robotic arm is that it doesn't lose time on moving the object over the shoot. That's the, one of the big differences from the spider type of the arms where they have to move the full way out outside of the conveyor to to drop the material into the suit. The recycle arm is working differently. It picks the object, turns towards the suit and blows it into the suit, which speeds up the operation as well, clears the nozzles, makes sure that everything is working there as well, fine and fast. So I like it. We're able to work between, let's say even 30 up to 55 peaks per minute. I've seen the machine working slower. I've seen the machine working much faster comparing to, I think an average of 35 peaks per minute for an employee. It makes, it makes a big difference. It's, it is working definitely faster. Fantastic. And, and my final question, uh, how many robots would you want to see on your site? As many as possible. Thank <laughs> you.